Okay, so um, I found a rather uh, really easy, really easy um, fix to this, where um, essentially instead of using Scott's animation light service, I have gone ahead and uh, used mine instead. So as you can see, this is my uh, keyframe sequence player here. As you can see, uh, and if we play this. As you can see, look at that. It works. It works great. It works amazing. While, if we actually, if we remove this, let's put this somewhere else, shall we? Let's put it here. And I uh, use Scott's, like, own uh, animation light service. So let's click select here. Go into anim. Click load. Wow, wow. So this is the animation right here. That, to show you guys, that's how it's supposed to look. Um. Okay, now it's not even moving. <laughs> That's really interesting. That's really interesting. What about this? No, that that. Mm. Okay, but you get the point. For some reason, it's not it's not running. But that's fine. But uh, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. And what I do is uh have this add script to rig to play this animation. And so if I click OK, it's gonna it's gonna have this little animation light service here. But if I play this, you're gonna see oh shit, it's wrong. It's real fucking wrong. Uh, while my own thing uh, actually runs a lot better somehow, <laughs> which I don't really understand why. Because on the test place, it actually works really smoothly. I uh, even made like a little animation on it if I could show you guys. But uh, I think this course like little file limit is gonna not allow that. Anyways, yeah. That's all. So, bye-bye.